Hi guys. Today our question is for the circuit shown in the figure consists of 500 ohms resistor connected in series with 25 milli henrys coil. 5 volts RMS 5 kilo hedge signal is applied. Okay, find Z current I phase angle theta voltage across resistance and voltage across inductance. Let us consider the voltage across resistance as Vr and the voltage across inductance as let us say Vl. Okay, so along with this we have to find impedance Z current I phase angle theta okay. and this is the circuit which was given it is an RL series circuit RL series circuit okay here so what we have to do is we have to find Z in the first step Okay, so to find Z initially we have to find XL. XL is equal to omega L, which is equal to omega in the sense 2 pi F into L. Okay, so here it is 2 pi into what is the frequency? 5 kilo H, 5 into kilo in the sense 10 cube 2 pi F into inductance 25 milli Henry's in the sense 25 into 10 power minus 3. This 10 power minus 3 and 10 power minus 3 will get cancelled. And now the result will be 785.4 ohms. Okay. So on calculating this thing we will get xl as 785.4 ohms okay and now as we got xl we can represent impedance in rectangular form impedance z in rectangular form So that is Z is equal to what is R 500 plus J 785.4. So this is the representation of impedance in rectangular form. Now Z is equal to root over R square plus XL square. R square plus XL square which is equal to root over what is R 500 whole square plus what is XL 785.4 whole square 785.4 whole square okay now we will get 931.4 Zero 04 ohms. What are its units? Ohms. Okay, this is about Z. Now we have to find a phase angle theta. So for RL series circuit, theta equal to tan inverse of tan inverse of xl by r so which is equal to tan inverse of what is xl 785.4 by r is equal to 500 we will get 
57.51 degrees. And here we have to find current also that is I is equal to source voltage Vs by Z. What is Vs? Which is equal to 5 volts. And what is Z? Z is equal to 931.5. Zero four ohms. So, which is equal to five point three milliamps. And next thing is, we have to find the voltage across resistance and voltage across inductance. Okay. So, we got. Theta, Z, and I. Okay. Now, in polar form, in polar form, represent Z as Z at an angle theta. No. So here, Z is equal to Z 931.04 at an angle. How much it is? 57.51 degrees. Okay. In polar form, we we'll represent. Z like this. Here we have to find the voltage across resistance. That is, Vr. Vr is simply I into R. The current is 5.3 milliamps into resistance is 500 ohms, which is equal to 2.65 volts. Okay. And similarly, we can find Vl. What is Vl? Vl is equal to simply I into Xl. I is 5.3 milliamps and what is Xl? Xl is 785. It is 785.4. It is equal to 4.5. Volts. Okay, so this is across the inductor, and this one is across resistance. So V R and V L are four. Okay, now if we want to verify whether this uh, V R and V L are correct or not, we have the source voltage V S is equal to root over V R square plus V L square. Okay. So, which is equal to root over 2.65 whole square plus 4. Point, it is 16 whole square. It is around 4.9 volts and it is approximately equal to 5 volts. Okay. So, voltage across resistance and inductance are here. It was asked to find. So it was it was asked to find uh, impedance, current I, phase angle theta, voltage across resistance, and voltage across inductance. See here, what is the value of Z? It is 931.04 ohms. That is impedance. Impedance. And next current is 5.3 milliamps. 5.3 milliamps. Phase angle theta is equal to 57.51 degrees. And voltage across a resistance. Voltage across resistance that is V R is equal to 2.65 volts. And voltage across inductance V L is equal to 4.16 volts. Okay. Thank you.